Welcome, Nipa. And Hi. the dice is all yours. Hi. Can you guys hear me? Yeah. Thank you, everyone, for being here this afternoon. Um, I'm actually really fortunate to have been the part of the Gumrah journey right from the beginning. And I still remember how hesitant we were to do this show in the first season. Can you? Yeah. Uh, first season. Uh, because for the first time, we were seeing TV viewers as consumers, and they are facing a very serious, relevant issue, which nobody was ready to discuss in public. And it was challenging because it was going against everything that we thought was a success successful youth format show. Uh, however, we were really proud that we took the bold move to launch Gumra because it carved a whole new genre in the entertainment space where we were talking about true life incidents. And after that, a lot of different uh, crime sh format shows were, uh, were launched by many other Hindi entertainment channels in the space. Uh, we were also really proud that parents actually wrote back to us saying how they would advocate their kids to, act, to watch this particular show over any other show. So we just showed how relevant this issue was even for the parents. Um, by the third season, Gumra was not just a show. It had actually become a brand. And on the back of this brand, we launched a couple of interesting initiatives, one of them being With You Safety App, which I think most of you all here would be aware of. And it's actually crossed 1.5 million downloads. So people are wary about safety. They do feel that things around are getting unsafe. And they see this show more as an education as to how to deal with situations like that, which I don't think there is there's any other platform where they First of all, welcome. It's great to have you here. Gumra, you said you love the show. What is the first thing that you love about this show? The fact that they're taking real life incidents and they're dramatizing them and highlighting some of the issues we have in our country. I think that that is the catch for me. That's very, uh, that's the only, one of the only shows in uh, India which actually says it's the circumstances that make a man do something wrong. So it's about finding out what those circumstances were. So does that interest you a lot, that aspect of the show? Yeah, because I also am of the belief that nobody's born a thief, nobody's born a rapist, nobody's born a criminal. And I think what they face in life, situations, circumstances, um, is what makes them who they are. You are the result of your environment just as much as I am a result of my environment. That's right, the way we are groomed up and the things that uh, are around us. When Channel V approached you, what was the reaction? Other than the big smile, what was the reaction? Because actor, producer, and now oh, Channel V, Gumra, what was the reaction like? I was quite sure that um, I wasn't probably going to host anything on TV. Uh, you know, I was busy doing my films, and I am shooting back to back right now. But I couldn't resist this one because I think, first of all, this, you know, their motto, the saying, the belief that you're not born a criminal, that resonated with me. Secondly, um, the stories that they were exploring. Um, third, the format, you know, the dramatization. So I was like, okay, you know, why not? I can take some time out of my schedule to do this because it is just so much for a larger cause, you know, and I really feel that something like this should be showcased and people have embraced it already, so why not? Okay, so you're excited about the whole association with Channel yeah, V? Of course. What is that one thing we can look forward to seeing Abed will do on the show? Something unique from your side. What would you like to bring? Because you're someone who prepares a lot, I know about that. So tell us what you'll, what you'll be bringing on to this show from your side. Uh, what am I bringing on? Yeah, show no nahi bhi likha hai, unhone research ki hai, itna acha kaam ke in logo ne. You know, I'm not going to take the credit away. Uh, I am here just to follow orders. I show up on time, and I, at most I will sit and discuss with the writer. Um, you know, if if there's something that the show is saying that. I personally don't believe in. I will then you know, discuss and ask them, why are you saying this? What does it mean when you say that? And actually, right now, I haven't really clashed with my opinions with the channels at all so far. So, so that's great. A lot of it's resonance happening. Yeah, uh, we are on the same boat. And uh, when there is a little bit of disagreement, then it's a matter of 
rewording things a little bit. Okay. You so, know, so and that's my only little. Um, the, I, we only once or twice have I reworded something because I didn't, I didn't believe in what was being said, and the writers worked with me to to make it universal. You know. Okay, so we also are uh, excited about uh, the trailer that's supposed to. We have a video that's been prepared. So do you all want to see the the video? So Abhay, can we have you? Promo. It's just a promo. You don't so have to Abhay, a lot of celebrities will be also joining you on the show. So that's another interesting aspect of this. Uh, so uh, and they are also going to come in and share real life stories. Anything that happened with you that आपने कभी ऐसा कुछ देखा हो कहीं कि कोई कुछ जैसे कि महात्मा गांधी ने कहा था punish the crime but not the criminal. So एक एक बार हुआ था मेरे साथ बहुत देर पहले मैं बीच पर जॉगिंग कर रहा था और ये कुछ पंद्रह साल की बात है मतलब कि and so I'm jogging on the beach and दूर से मैंने देखा कि कुछ औरतें खड़ी हुई थी और एक बंदे ने एक ले एक औरत का you know सर पकड़ के बाल पकड़ के उसको मारना शुरू कर दिया like he literally caught her head and he like hit her with his knee and so so और सारी औरतें अपनी चप्पल उतार के उसको मार रही थी लेकिन उसने बस उसके बाल पकड़े हुए थे and he wasn't letting her go तो मैं जॉगिंग से मेरा रन बन गया जब तक मैं वहाँ पहुँचा of course चार पांच लोग खड़के देख रहे थे जैसे पिक्चर है कोई कुछ करता नहीं है तो I jumped in and मैंने कोशिश की कि इसको सेपरेट कर पाऊँ और I managed to separate him and I said ये क्या कर रहा है तू पागल है क्या औरत है तू you know why you hitting her he saying साली मेरे को पूछते कि मेरा रेट क्या है so apparently this woman had gone up to him and asked him how much he charges so I looked at the woman and I was confused I was like जो भी है बॉस अगर उसने पूछ भी लिया you have no right to hit her he says नहीं ऐसा नहीं हो सकता मैं यहाँ से हूँ और ऐसी कैसी औरतें and blah 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 and by that time जो crowd खड़ा हुआ था क्योंकि उन्होंने देखा कि एक बंदा कुछ कर रहा है तो उन लोगों ने सब शुरू कर दिया उसको मारना तो मैंने बोला यार चल police station चलते हैं and I told the women इसको police station ले जाते हैं क्योंकि जो भी था बाजू में ही है बोला नहीं नहीं भैया आप ही ले जाओ इसको police station हम नहीं आएंगे so I was like अब तेरा chance है तू चुप हो जा निकल जा यहाँ से वरना � and then finally, when I separated the public from beating him up, I said, "Up to jai yahan se." And my jog bhi kharaab ho gaya us din. Okay, so incidences ऐसे होते रहते हैं where people end up doing things they're not supposed to do. What's your message to the youth here today who will be watching this? This is going live, I think, on a lot of uh, digital platforms also. So, what's the message to the youth that you have? Um, my message is, uh, I mean, I'm not one to give a message to anyone. You know, I live my life the way I'd like to live it. I give. I do my work honestly. I give it my hundred percent. I try and live my life in a way that I don't harm others or myself. And uh, the only advice I can give to the youth is, uh, you know, have a direction in life. Uh, do unto yourselves what you would do to others. Do not, do not harm others because you don't want to harm your own self. So why would you harm anybody else? And have a direction in life. Have, be passionate about something. You know, have a vision for yourself and never let anybody put you down. So that's uh, your message coming in. Have a passion in life. Don't do unto others what you don't want others to do unto you. So, and that's the message coming in from Abhay. Thank you for being here with Thank us, you Abhay. For having you. But now, as of now, I'm going to ask you to please uh, take your seat. Sure. And. Uh, अगर आप 1980s या 1960s की बच्चे की बात करो, वो बात अलग है। 
आजकल शिक्षा इतनी बढ़ गई है कम्युनिकेशन इतना बढ़ गया है कि मुझे इसमें कोई दुविधा नहीं है कि 16 साल के बच्चे एडल्ट्स हैं और अच्छी तरह समझते हैं उनके गुनाह के कॉन्सिक्वेंसेस क्योंकि खास करके जब ऐसे लॉज पास होंगे मान लीजिए 1960 में 1980 में ऐसा लॉ पास हुआ तो कौन जाने कि ये लॉ पास हुआ है सिर्फ वो बच्चे जो अखबार पढ़ते हैं या दूरदर्शन का न्यूज़ देखते हैं आजकल हर मीडिया इतना बढ़ गया है न्यूज़ चैनल्स इतने बढ़ गए हैं सोशल मीडिया इतना बढ़ गया है ऐसे मैसेज इतने इस्तेमाल होते हैं तो इसकी खबर जब बाहर जाएगी जब उसका प्रसारण होगा कि 16 साल के लड़के एडल्ट्स हैं और जो वो करते हैं उनको वही सजा दी जाएगी जो एडल्ट्स को दी जाएगी तो ये खबर फैलेगी और बहुत ही डिटरेंट डिटरेंस क्रिएट करेगा बहुत ही बहुत ही रुकावट उनके ख़राब कामों में करेगी क्योंकि न किसी चीज़ को न जानना एक एक एक, एक पाप है और ये पाप आजकल नहीं पॉसिबल है क्योंकि जो भी नए कानून आते हैं इस किस्म के कानून उसका प्रसारण होता है और लोग उससे सबक सीखते हैं सो इन शॉर्ट इन्फॉर्मेशन सबके पास है जी और अगर उनको इन पास इन्फॉर्मेशन है तो उनको अपना परिणाम जानना चाहिए क्योंकि हर लॉ के दो 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 पहलू होते हैं एक होता है डिटरेंस दूसरा होता है पनिशमेंट तो डिटरेंस इज मोर इम्पोर्टेंट दैन पनिशमेंट अगर okay. लोग लॉ जानकर डर जाते हैं तो शायद वो गुना न करें ओके बट दैट्स अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन आई आई थ्रो द बॉल इन नीतीश सर्स कोर्ट राइट नाउ सर कबीर यू आर वन ऑफ आवर आवर एम्बेसडर्स व्हिच आई लाइन आई एम यस हाउ कैन यू से दैट दैट्स बिकॉज़